As I said, today is um, the fourth day following my operation and I had my follow-up appointment with Dr. Becker at her office today at the American Hospital in Paris. Um, you can probably see some little bandages on the side of my arm here. That's where they've, oh, ouch, taken out the lymph nodes from and put them into my leg above my knee. And um, I have to say that I'm in so much pain. Like this is the only area that I'm in a lot of pain is here, like in my shoulder and um, in my arm here and going down to here. Not because of the incision, not because of taking stuff out, just because my arm was stretched in a really weird position. I don't know how, but um, it's been left like that the whole surgery. And say for like two and a half, three hours, it's been stretched and kept in that position. And I'm sure that there's some pretty serious muscle damage happening there. Anyway, my follow-up appointment went really, really well. Um, it's really weird to hear what she said to me considering having spent three years of being told there's no cure, there's nothing you can do to fix this, you just have to deal with it, um, sorry, uh, yeah, you have a fat leg for the rest of your life, um, no, it's not going to get better. So after hearing all that and seeing Dr. Becker today, showing her my leg, she was like, what the hell has happened here? This is amazing. I can't believe you have these results already four days after your surgery. And I was like, yep, I know. Like, it, it feels like a miracle. It feels like a miracle to have this leg attached to me now that I don't even recognize because four days ago it was the size of a tree trunk and it was firm and it was not moving my calf wouldn't budge and now I can like wobble it it goes like this it's like blah, 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 blah. my calf moves um the liquid looks like it's almost all gone from between my ankle and my and my knee so to see this uh within four days she said it was a fantastic result so far and um that I will probably back, be back to normal and when she said this to me, like, you know, you take it with a pinch of salt, grain of salt, whatever the expression is, but um, just the complete opposite of what you've been told, what I've been told for the last three years is, um, is pretty, uh, it takes your breath away. Or should I say it's given me my breath back, like I feel like I can breathe again, that I have been told this by a doctor, that I have hope. And that's all, that's all it is, I have hope that I'm going to have an improvement in my condition and um, yeah, four days already, it's looking really good and um, you know, she said I need to wait a full year at least to see proper results but if I do the proper bandaging, and uh, which I, of course I will do uh, following this surgery and put the bandages every day, make sure I'm really consistent with that, swim, um, do my manual lymphatic draining massage, I'm going to be doing it four times a week for the next month and then I can gradually decrease that um, if I just keep on top of all of that then hopefully I'll have results a lot faster so yeah pretty pretty um, breathtaking uh, a rendezvous today with Dr Becker